Back off at YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Let us make this delicious shrimp with vegetables. So as I mentioned in my previous videos, I'm doing a no red meat or chicken challenge for the month of January. This is just a little challenge that I set for myself and my family. So yes, on today's menu, we're making some shrimp with vegetables. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to wash all of my vegetables before chopping it up. I'm using this crinkle cutter that I got from Amazon and I'm cutting my carrots. I'm now going to use a knife and then I'm just going to clean and chop off every other vegetable and put it into my bowl. So once everything was prepped, I went ahead and just added it to my bowl, give it a quick rinse again and then set it to one side. I'm using this jumbo shrimp and I already cleaned and deveined it. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and use some paper towels just to tap off any excess moisture. I am gonna season it lightly with just some all-purpose seasoning, black pepper and some mixed herbs. However, you can season yours however you like, okay?
so this was my shrimp nicely seasoned so to a clean pan i'm gonna go ahead and add in some butter i'm using some kerrygold butter allow it to melt before going in with your shrimp because my shrimp is the jumbo shrimp i am gonna let it cook for about five six minutes and after about three four minutes i'm just gonna flip it over on the opposite side so that it's cooked fully once my shrimp is cooked, I am going to remove it from the pot and set it in a clean plate just so we can steam our veg. Now that the shrimp is cooked, in goes our washed veg. But first, let's add in a little bit more mixed herbs. The Spice Jamaica seasoning can be found by checking out his website www.spicejamaica.com I really love this seasoning and the chef is my personal friend, so Chef Ali, big up! This is the nicest seasoning I've probably ever used. So yes, my darlings, after you put in your seasonings, quick mix i am not gonna add any liquid or anything to this i am literally just gonna allow it to steam it's gonna spring a little bit of liquid and if you don't want your veggies to be soggy don't add anything to it okay cover it put it on the lowest heat and then after about five minutes this is how it looks okay you don't want this to be watery and soggy so hence the reason i do mine like this and i never have any complaints I'm now going to go back in with my cooked shrimp and I'm going to give it a good mix before covering it up for about 2 more minutes and this will be ready. So this is it all done my darlings all done i really hope you enjoy this easy shrimp with vegetables if you're into chicken you can always just check out my chicken with vegetables recipe and yes my loves it is just as delicious and tasty as this one i really hope you enjoy it try it soon let me know how you like it it's been a pleasure having you here and i will see you again in my next one thank you for watching Bye bye